Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and, uh, well, we're back. <laughs> yes, Seven has returned from the dungeon and is now back for another video for everyone. Uh, this is Music Monday, as you full well know. Definitely coming to you on a Monday, uh, as usual. And today, we are going to be checking out, uh, an album by a rapper from my town. Now, this isn't the first time I've reacted to uh, an album from a rapper from my town, as uh, if you look way back in the past, about probably just under a year ago, I released a, a reaction reacting to uh, Prologue by Ashen, who was another rapper from Dunedin. Uh, but today, we're coming at you with somebody different. This is Subject 95. Uh, now, I can't really tell you much about him, but he makes music, obviously, which, what? Yeah, cool. Uh, <laughs> he makes music, uh, and uh, he's done a bit, so if I go into his uh, channel, he's released, uh, in the past, uh, he has released a Homicide remix, uh, which is, of course, the song by Logic, uh, off of his Confessions of a Dangerous Mind album, which featured Eminem on it, uh, and then he's also released, uh, a Smoke Free Rock Quest, uh, video, which, if you don't know, Smoke Free Rock Quest is sort of like a, uh, na nationwide, uh, event for, uh, uh, rock bands and things like that. Uh, it's a competition where basically uh, the best people get selected from each regional like town. So like for example in New Zealand we have like uh, Dunedin, Christchurch, Wellington, Auckland example and all the other regional areas as well. They'll select people from there and then they go to the final which is in Auckland and then eventually someone wins and then the winner gets like some money and like a music video or some something like that. So that's what Rock Quest is. But covering that aside, the main thing we're here to react to is uh, Subject 95's album. Now this album uh, released not too long ago, uh, only being a couple months. So I'm a couple months late. But yes, this is uh, his album, which is titled The Comeback. Now. Um, Pretty easy to see why it would be titled The Comeback, considering, like myself, before he released this, he hadn't uploaded anything for quite some time. But, uh, yeah, he's come through and delivered this album, which is a 14-track album, uh, featuring, uh, just himself by the looks of things. Doesn't look like we're gonna see any features on this one. That's alright, though, because as people know, uh, you don't need features on an album to make it good, you just need the album to be good. But, uh, okay, so, uh, without further ado, we shall jump into this. This is, uh, the compact. And we're gonna start off with the first track of the album, which is titled Self Repair. interesting sort of uh, theatrical type uh, intro to start off this song. Would make sense, kind of, considering this is the first song. Also, before I continue the song, uh, I'd never point it out, but there's the uh, cover art for the uh, album. Looks pretty cool, sort of like a, uh, this is supposed to represent Earth, I'm assuming, and then there's like some explosions. And then you've got like, here in the background you can see like, sort of the area where he comes from, and then this is obviously Subject 95 himself. It's pretty, it's pretty cool looking album, very nicely designed. Uh, let's get back into the song. Took some time away, left with my thoughts each day. Myself up off the floor. I just couldn't take any more. I picked up the broken pieces. Okay. Soon they all will see. Nobody can think to defeat this new version of me. If you think I'm pathetic, then you're gonna regret it. You should go and forget it. Bitch, I still got the credit. Quarter in, so changing the game like I have never before. I'm black. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Interesting, so he started off with a more like singing thing and then progressed into the song. 
Uh, but he said uh, uh, something about quarters and then change. That was a good line there. Let me see if I can find it. Bitch, I still got the credit. Quarter in, so changing the game like I Quarter in, so changing the game. You know, because a quarter is uh, a coin, so you got... But it's also a small increment of money, so, you know, change, quarter change. Yeah, that was good, but also quarter change probably implying to something else. So, nice bar there from Subject95. I have never before, I'm blasting everything in my way, getting that big high score. I've been away for too long, thinking of these little songs, building up all of my energy so I could come out strong. All of this shit happened to me, but that's just naturally making myself grow. Ain't no way that this shit damaging me. I heard the thunder and the rain, I lost my mind. I thought it time to leave all of that shit behind. I was in the massive graveyard and had to smooth all the creases. I searched and random, picked up all my random pieces. Then I managed to get myself on the bench. Finally, I'm glad I was out of the damn trench. I welded myself together, then picked up the wrench. Tightened my joints, now you. I welded myself together and picked up the wrench and then he's talking about tightening the joints because you use a wrench to tighten up like bolts and nuts to get them tighter so also implying that to the fact you know he's tightening up him his rhymes and you know getting better as a rapper so again nice bit of wordplay there's a few bars here and there that I'm catching but for the most part it seems like this song seems to be talking about the fact that he was stuck down in s some dark place whatever it was and he's got himself out of that predicament and is now on sort of a road to recovery type basis but yeah so far this song not too bad it's it's a pretty good start to the album so far we're only halfway in though, so we'll continue and finish it off. You know what happens next. Yeah. On my way out, I saw some things that made me laugh. Yeah. I found and pulled on the Jason Mass. Yeah. I took ah, a sip from him. Jason Mass, yep, reference to the uh, Jason and Freddy movies, like Friday the 13th. That, yep. Mountain Dew Flask. A question go? you no longer need to ask. Cause here's your answer. I'm shooting back like I never have. Yeah. I hit rock bottom, now I'm going up, and all you should be. My brain went together, these emotions like I'm sad and mad, but don't feel bad. Yeah. I'm releasing all I had. This will keep me going for a while. Woo. And through this mask, you see a hint of a smile. Woo. And don't you dare think that it's meant to be vile. Cause I've cried all of my tears and knocked them up in the vile. Yeah. Saved it for later, and now I'll finally have a taste. Tell myself, this is what it's like when you feel like yeah. a waste. And so now that my head's been knocked down straight, maybe I'll release all this hate just to release all this bang, weight. Bang, and I'll sit down with my plate. Go and evil, don't you try and tempt me Well to be honest, I don't think that you can Because the person standing before you today is who I am This is my moment where I'm feeling the best ever I'll constantly tell myself that I can do better Honestly, I hope it's the way it'll stay Treaded through waters and Sakura means I'm ready to play Ooh, good bar there to finish off uh, Inserted a quarter means I'm ready to play Because uh, if you... Think about most of like, um, they're like core machines, usually you'd have to insert like, back in the days you'd have to insert like quarter change in order to play it. Uh, nowadays you got like, I think it's most of them will take like two dollar, one dollar coins. But I think back in like the 70s, 80s, they used to be quarter change like what he's saying. So, that was a good bar there to finish off anyway, and so far, pretty good first track to start off our album. Not many... Not many bars, but you know, I, I sort of see this considering it's called self-repair as this is a more like reflective song within this album. Talking about, you know, as I mentioned earlier, how he was stuck in that dark place and got out of it and he's now looking towards a brighter future. But yeah, not bad to start off uh, the first track for this album. So that was self-repair and now we move on to uh, the next track, which is the title track, The Comeback. Ooh, okay. This beat, this beat's going, okay. Ooh, I'm, al I'm already feeling this beat, you know, he's got that like, he's got that like pulsating uh, bass type thing to it, like you can hear it here. Not, not this, that, that boom boom. It's like a pulsating bass in there, and then he's got like the Which is like, uh, sort of like a, uh, 
I'd assume probably like uh, uh, is the sort of melody for the song and uh, that would probably be more than likely piano I would assume but yeah so far I'm digging the vibe of this so we'll see how he comes into it I suppose <laughs> That you didn't want me around Nope Now I'm here with a new sound But since hey. the crowd would've known Was clapping There's something strange and new That I just found what? Out All of my friends are great But my thoughts have been coming away I lay up awake Feeling all the ache Wondering why hey. I hey. always been hey. a break What was that I said? No one really cares This just isn't fair Who's that over there? No one knows this guy Why does he just cry? Just look at his eyes He's a loser by hey. the, the flow The flow is good He's kicking in with the beat You know like dun 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 It's going along with the beat as well Because the beat's so he's getting that transposition of being that one-on-one -on -one, like ratio within the beat which is uh, very good so far you know uh, I'm catching a few lines here and there that are not too bad but overall it feels like he's you know just barely getting warmed up into it as we are and we're about 20 seconds into it so we'll, we'll uh, see how we Continues through the song. Maybe jealousy is why I'm so mean. Cause the followers ain't showing on my screen. No, so far I guess I'm in the race scene. And I haven't made it out on the rap team. Yeah. I guess I can hold back for a while. I just need to drive those extra big miles. I just need to go Oof. through the extra tough trials. And leave my notes in extra big piles. But after the music box played this final song, I took a step back and just walked along. I wanted to improve, to come back strong. But the road to return was pretty long. Hey. Everyone around me just stared. They tried to extract, but I didn't share. I knew in my mind they were not prepared. I started to feel they were feeling the fear. Woo. And that's that. I'm glad and I'm back and I'm here going on the attack And for you here's this little fact I gotta get all the shit that's been taking off my back Damn. Wanna take the piss out of my name you Say it all weird to say that I'm lame For my downfall you're to blame You gave me shame, not a claim huh. I've had enough of your games You have ignited the flame I will no longer be tame I've written your names and I'm now taking aim bang, I never bang. like to take a break from the mic But I had to make sure that my feelings are right Or it will build up is what I should say Cause none of your shit could keep me at bay nah. Now I come off from doing the deed My song's in the past I had a quick read and my god I had to concede, I had zero bars and 100% oh, When you see me, I'm incredible, but others taking edibles I'll take you well down to how to your skeletal Find my next opponent, so I'll try my best to own it And I think my scars would have shown it You wanna try get technical? Not a sensibility, when you're not looking I'll take a chemical, mix it in lean That's hurting your spleen, you puke like a nuke That's something I've seen! Hey. Yep, absolute shit! Thinking back then I could actually spit! Well, have no fear, for I have returned Precision speed is something I've learned hey, I'm thinking hey. this moment is my chance to grow I'm thinking my rise will happen quite so But I'll track and I'll push and I'll heave through the snow And rise like I'm yeast and makes it reinstall Oh, rise like I'm used to make serious dough. There's there's a good bar there. I mean, I've heard I've heard that line, you know, transposed through many records. I mean, I've even myself made that uh, bar on one of my tracks. Uh, I think Eminem mentioned that one uh, on Majesty as well. He said, uh, "Built be cross, I'm built to rise like yeast" or something like that. So you know, a very a very common bar, but still uh, still getting a nice uh, bar in there. And then he mentioned something else about a, a spaceship as well, uh, uh, a bit further before, uh, which was quite a nice bar there as well. So, you know, here and there, he's dropping bars, and the thing I'm enjoying the most about this song as I'm listening through it uh, is the fact that he's sort of changing up the uh, pattern of how he's rhyming uh, in this song. Like, uh, he started off, you know... A bit more relaxed and then in this like middle to second half we're getting into now he's starting to like bring the energy more and you can f hear the uh sort of punch and his bringing with it as well and stuff it's very cool to see from subject 95 seems like he really uh put a bit of time to craft together this album and it's sort of showing as we're only a track and a third well two thirds in we'll say and uh Already, so far, it's been not too bad for something made by an artist that's local to my town. I'm bred for this game, come from a different cloth. Yeah, you see that I'm burning so bright, I'm attracting all the moths. Woo! But I have this little thought that makes my mouth begin to throb. What? Maybe I'd like a girl who was a bit of a goth. Damn. Anyway, all dreaming aside, I hope you're enjoying the ride. Yeah! Cause this ain't no average thing, you'll scream and you'll cry and you'll sing. 
represent for Berlin, help with hand, crush your brand, catch your hand, motherland, where the land music stand, up a hand, fire brand, no one really gives two shits about you, Gucci gang, longevity does not exist, a hit. Okay, he's, he's, he's gone down the Eminem route with, with that little eight bar in there, <laughs> just the, cause uh, if you remember on Eminem's song, I think it was not a like, he, he was like, uh, finger bang, chicken gang, uh, what, what, uh, you know the line, he's like, finger bang, chicken gang, da 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 will pump, Lil Zane ain't saying anything, something along those lines. I can't remember, cause it's been a while since I've obviously listened to Kamikaze, but yeah. Uh, so it's something along those lines, but yeah, he's sort of interpolating that into his rhyme here and giving it in his own style, and uh, taking shots at Will Pump, <laughs> Gucci Gang. I mean, personally, uh, for me, yeah, that's I'm not really digging that song, but you know, I mean, what can I say? If if Will Pump somehow watches this reacts to it, then um, yeah, uh, the ball's in your court. <laughs> I suppose. Anyway, uh, we'll continue on and finish off this uh, uh, song. This song for two minutes and that's it. Yeah. A one hit wonder drop shit. Then he decides that he should quit. Fuck. I don't plan to give in. I take the shots on my chin. Even if the. Hey, wow, he's still going at oil pump there. He, he said a one hit wonder and then he quit. Some. Something like that. I believe you'll find that actually Lil Pump was more than a one-hit wonder. Because, <laughs> uh, he- Lil Pump's had his fair share of hits regardless of, you know, how the media and certain people, including how subjects referencing him here, uh, says. You know, Lil Pump has put in his grind and, uh, definitely gotten the notoriety for stuff. Wh whether people enjoy the music or not, you can't deny that fact. So, well done, Lil Pump. Even though, personally, your music isn't for me. Chances are slim thin, I flip all the odds and I win. Hey. Apart from Welcome to the Party, because he killed that song. But everything else I've heard by him has been pretty, eh. Every time that I sit in my room, I take the time to just think. All the emotions I feel, I take it out on my ink. Blah. It really gives me a boost, when I feel like I'm on the brink. A smile and satisfaction, then take a sip of my drink. Hey. Alright, well, there's the title track, The Comeback, and, uh, yeah, some nice, uh, nice instrumental there. Really gets that, uh, uh, really gets that energy going, and, uh, I'm sure that if this was to be performed in front of an audience, it would probably definitely be a hit with the crowd, for sure, uh, with that beat, because that beat just has some, like, high energy about it, with the way that he's also delivering his lines in this song as well. Overall though, uh, pretty pretty good song. There's uh, There was quite a few good bars here and there with the yeast bar and uh, uh, the spaceship one and whatnot and stuff. But uh, again, he's sort of on the line of like progressing past like past tribula trials and tribulations, which it's which is cool. But yeah, this song definitely so far is uh, probably my favorite track. From the album of the two we've heard but yeah so not too bad of a start here for subject 95 um i'm enjoying this so far but we'll see uh what happens we still got another 12 songs to go so now we move on to the next song which is endless war track number three Okay, I'm gonna say right off the bat into track three. This album's got not too bad production, to be fair. So if this was all produced by uh, Subject 95 himself, uh, my props to you, because this is uh, some good production on this uh, album. But if this was made by somebody else, then uh, big up the producer, because th this is so far sounding pretty good. so cold but I'm doing fine it's what I've been told I'm sad in everlasting darkness and I feel controlled I'm feeling anxious about what could unfold but I should get my head onto solid ground don't want to be overwhelmed if my problems are drown I think I'm safe 
I'm by myself Wait, what's that sound? You thought you were in the darkness alone Now look who you have found No Hey buddy, it's me Man, it's been a while I've been watching you recently And you've got quite a smile Man, don't kid yourself with happiness The joy I see is vile No, please go away I don't want another trial But you had fun when I was released Isn't that right? Think of all the people we sank our teeth in to bite They wanted to, it was their own choice They weren't tied Ah, uh, think of all the people we sank our teeth into to bite Ah, uh, referencing vampires Because the vampires, to suck out your blood They will literally bite into your neck Or into some part of your body And it literally suck the blood out So that could be perceived as sort of maybe a reference To the idea that he is feeding off of people's Hatred, quite literally. Uh, also, it seems like this is uh, sort of a double-edged uh, story here, as he sort of uh, got two different um, personalities. There we go, that's the word. Uh, personalities going on in this song, as I'm hearing it. So, it's giving an interesting uh, effect so far. Also, he had a bit of uh, singing at the start there. It's not too bad. It's definitely better than uh, some of the other singing I've heard. <laughs> Up tight. They wanted to stick by my side and they love what I write It doesn't matter anymore because you're all alone with me And there is no way in hell I'm never letting you go free The exit door cannot be simply unlocked with the key Oh man, I love stirring up your brain and making you go crazy Oh, what was that? I love stirring up your brain and making you go crazy Ah, uh, okay. Uh, that was a good bar there Uh, cause you know, stirring, stirring, cause if you stir someone up Usually they'll falter and you know because it's human nature and they'll go crazy on on you like releasing their anger Which is what he is describing here. So nice line there from subject 95 some some good He's dropping some good bars here and there that I am catching and you know, it's very good from him Say it again Okay, that part there might be the first tidbit I have to hate about this album. Bit overdone, and bit overdone in uh, that department in terms of uh, the "I hate you" line. Could it could have just like done with a few less "I hate you." <laughs> yeah, that 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 that's that's tidbit of me a bit. You done? I'm not quite here. Yeah. I barely said enough and I'm barely breaking a sweat It's always you make me do things that I regret You're the reason I can't be happy, you are the main threat I can't believe I opened the gate for you To nestle into your brain and make you do what you do I have one name to say if you try and defy me Okay bitch, I call you bluff, yeah, go ahead and try me Choice of words, your time is up Man, no, 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 you can't shut the fuck up, that's how you damage me? Bring up shit from my past? Wow, you blew up surprisingly fast. I've had enough for you. I finally found a dose of the happiness. Then you come around and you make everything a mess. Well, I can't deal with this. There's too much stress. So when you take over again, go on, say yes. I've had enough for you. This is my final stand here. Can't you see what I hold in my hand? Oh, come on. Really what you had planned. Of course it was. I finally had the chance to save my brand. You can't escape me, just give up. Just stop trying, cause I can tell by the poison that you were slowly dying. It doesn't matter what you do, you're returning with your regrets. I don't let you try to do something, this is your last chance. I'm done with your antics, thinking you control. I couldn't be free, you just watch and patrol You take away my freedom, you didn't borrow, you stole You took all I had and threw it in a hole I didn't even agree and I didn't sell my soul You just let you Man, he is really going against somebody here Whoever this other person is he's describing for this alternative personality of himself Is uh, obviously somebody he's having literally an endless war with So, yeah, I mean it's pretty uh, certain in this life that we're all going to have uh, our complications between other people. 
uh, as pretty much I foreknow well enough in my life, and I'm sure many p other people do watching uh, this video right now as well. Uh, so, uh, definitely something we can all relate to with this song here. And so far, he's doing pretty good, so we'll see how he ends out this one. Yourself in and you became a mo. You didn't live up to your outstanding grown up for the crimes you have committed, you will have to pay the toll. Just calm down, wait, surely we can reason Trespassing to my brain, isn't that a treason? But just wait, surely the heart you have is still beating You make me go nuts, I won't leave you breathing Come on, just wait, surely there can be something I can do Think about your persona, I'm a part of it True, but I've evolved now, and man, have I grown No So goodbye forever, because now, I don't need you A loud bang I'm awake, my eyes filled with light, and my whole body shakes. I'm breathing hard, I take a break. And I think I just got rid of the fake. Maybe now I can lay in the field of clover without somebody else having to take over. And the spark inside my head is finally over. I'm happy now because I finally have some closure. Ah, so that is. Endless War and okay, so I see now that last bit at the end give us gave, give us gave us the uh, the closure to what this song was about and essentially it's a uh, war in Subject 95's mind between himself and his haters which is uh, very well possessed there. It's always cool to see these uh, songs in which you have two sides of the coin interpolated into one. Like, uh, for example, a great version of this is uh, Eminem on uh, Music To Be Murdered By with the song uh, Darkness describing the uh, Las Vegas shooting because he describes it in such a un uh, unique and very awesome way with, you know, inside of the mind and the shooter and inside of the mind of himself as an artist. In the same way that sort of subjects doing here with, you know, in the mind of himself as the thoughts of thinking about his haters and then the haters themselves. So that was a very good song and uh, yeah, g gets across uh, the point of that song really nicely and uh, it's cool to see him coming with that style because it's sort of something different that I haven't really heard from a rapper in my town uh, before. So, very cool to see. Now we move on to track uh, number four, I believe, which is Harsh Reality. Every day while I'm dreaming of a future, but then I find it that I'm really just a loser. Man okay, Inter interesting start to this song. He's got sort of a more guitar-focused beat with this one. And so, sort of giving me off like a, uh, kind of like an, <laughs> I can't believe I'm saying this, but kind of like an anime style, uh, um, musicality to it with that guitar, uh, which is interesting, but, uh, we'll see how he carries himself into this song. Future, but then I find it that I'm really just a oh, wait, I'll have to go back a wee bit. Every day while I'm dreaming of a future But then I find it that I'm really just a loser Man, I really wanna be with you But you don't see us the same way that I do Talking to you is just a mess Gives me stress, trying to say all the right things But you just say yes The conversation is completely one-sided My true feelings, well, I'm not trying to hide it I show my advances and what I say All the words I feed you, you just throw them away For another day, we're sitting in a pool of grey Take away all the strength and courage I have to make you say Well, if it worked, I wouldn't have to make this whole thing We could have felt the singer at the worst be a quick fling well, we didn't. Well, we're not. Well, I'm trapped. Guess I got caught. What do I have to do to get a good talk going? I'm set back from all the chances that I'm blowing. Didn't even tell me what was wrong. Response time became longer, and you didn't play along. Was having fun, and I thought that we clicked. But then it turns out I was just in the shit. You built something up just to watch me fall. Nothing about that was amusing at all. Here's some advice and listen to what I say. Leave toying with boys' emotions for another day. Damn. Okay, so this is uh, definitely a song about relationships, and you know, even from the get-go, the first, like, or second line there, you know, when I wake up, I feel like I'm what, what, something, and then, I, but I'm still a loser. But then I find it that I'm really just... Every day while I'm dreaming of a future, but then I find it that I'm really just a loser. 
that line, every day I'm dreaming of a future, but then I realize I'm just a loser. Like, how many people have been in that spot where you, you know, you like dream for an aspiration and goal, and then you work so, so hard to try and approach that goal or reach that goal, only to realize that you are, in fact, as he says here, just a loser because you can't reach the goal and you know you feel so down in the depths of you know yourself that you're never going to be able to make this goal and whatnot which by the way if you are that person you know believe in yourself and you know keep going because at the end of the day you know while you may not get it today you may get it tomorrow or a week or a month year you know years it don't matter the grind eventually pays off. I mean, look at my channel. <laughs> I started in 2017 with barely any subscribers, and now here I am with virtually 170. So, you know, the eventual grind and payload eventually pays off, and yeah, you will make it. But yeah, a very good start to the song here, and uh, I'm enjoying this one so far as well. So far, four tracks in, and yeah, I'm gonna continue to say this has been a pretty good album so far. I can't lie, in that wee little intruded bit there, uh, it was a bit hard to hear what he was saying. I feel like the uh, instrumental was sort of overpowering his lyrics, so that was a little, uh, little uh, moment there that needs uh, a bit of tweaking, you know, like uh, you could have brought up the vocals or something, but yeah, I found that a bit hard to actually hear by ear. I'm not afraid to show emotion, you just cover it up, build a wall around, so you can't be found, slowly you'll start suffering until you drown, guess I'm not surprised because of how much I try, every time I try to talk to you, you're always with another guy, is anything Ooh. gonna change, can I please find somebody who will treat me less strange, I'd like to say I'm a respectful young lad, but all of your friends say that I'm evil and bad, oh. no one ever said the ones who beat me, mercilessly, my heart, my soul have gone completely black. Well, how about uh, that? Yeah. You just laugh while I'm down and you turn your back. Then you walk away to another day. Yeah, another day. There won't be another day. You saw the blood dripping. You heard the bones crack. So kiss your ass goodbye because you're never coming back. Pretty straightforward there. <laughs> Basically saying get lost. Ever heard of that old saying good things come to those who wait well now and again there you go in that lyric literally describing what I just said uh, a few moments ago about you know working hard to bes to uh, achieve your goals you know good things do come to people who wait so that's why it's such a good moral saying I've got a spring in my step I think that all sounds great I'll take my time to find her it ain't gonna happen now Gotta find that perfect someone, I just gotta find that how. The ink that I write with on the page, it all flows into a dark puddle. These poems I have in my hand, sound like a harsh reality. But the poems that I have here, they won't make up my ending. I'm about to pave my own way, make my reality. And my reality, if I haven't found enough yet. <laughs> I'll leave a beat Again, another good song. Like, he's, so far he is not failing to disappoint with this album. Definitely not failing, as we are now four tracks into this 14-track album. And, you know, it is pretty good so far. He is keeping exactly to how I'd imagine this to be, so it is very good. Uh, but now we're going to continue on into track number five. This is Lullaby.
I know to you I am a D unknown But I cannot help but notice that you're out here all alone Did you not think it too dangerous to be out here on your own? Walked all the way out into the woods without even your phone? Well don't be scared of me and put a smile on that face And while you're here feel free to frolic all around this place I know all about you all, you guys on that little quest To journey throughout the land and to be the very best I see you having fun in the woods as you play I almost get the feeling that you're wanting to stay Well I have a suggestion bit creepy to end off that uh, first line, but it sounds like this is uh, quite a tragic story of uh, somebody getting kidnapped by the sounds of the first thing. Because, you know, it starts off as a, you know, a whole uh, fun adventure of just, you know, holding hands and walking through the forest, you know, classic, classic sort of horror movie starts. And then, it, and then, you, you know, you get kidnapped into a cave. Oh, sorry, yep, there, there, there you go. Sorry, you, you, you're gone. <laughs> you just disappear, magically, just, and you're gone. <laughs> yeah, I laugh about it, but the reality is these things do happen in real life, and it's an absolutely tragic circumstance to go through getting kidnapped i i would never wish it upon anyone and i would never wish for anyone to do it but unfortunately there are people that wicked in this world that would uh do such a thing uh but yeah so good start to the story uh story song we'll continue on uh with the rest of it It seems like he may have a feature on this song, because in this chorus I'm hearing him, and what doesn't sound like himself? Now, I don't know, I can't really verify whether or not that is himself and he's got his uh, vocals double layered, uh, or not, but if not, then uh, either way, this chorus is pretty good. Now look into my eyes, you hear the pentacle, you can hear the ticks echo through the cabin walls. The only thing in the room is the pendant, that's all. Back and forth, your eyelids fall, your minds are unraveling at the seams, allowing me to haunt all of your dreams. When your families find out the truth, they'll start to grieve, because oh, the two children, you cannot leave. Come little children, all you come with me, come with me on a journey through the trees. Children, you weren't very clever, and now you shall stay with me forever. Man, I gotta say, his storytelling on this uh, album as well is something also very good that I've noticed. You know, between between this song "Lullaby" and uh, track number uh, track number three, "Endless Walk." He's got a few good uh, songs of storytelling here as well, which is cool to see. But so far, I haven't really seen an album that really... An album? I haven't really seen a song on this album so far that really showcases uh, Subject 95's lyrical ability. Because uh, he, here and there, he's dropping bars throughout songs, but uh, at me, as a raging, you know, uh, lyrical rapper head, uh, 
I'm sort of, sort of, when I listen to music, I'm always listening for the bars and how people deliver them and, you know, catching the double entendres and things like that, as you would have noticed so far through this reaction. Uh, but yeah, I, I mean, apart from that, this album is, I, I, again, I really have to say, it's, it's pretty good of an album. Next up, track six, Never Alone. And then, and there you go. So actually, this album was released 25th of April. So just, just, just before April. And you can see he's even put all the lyrics there so you can read through the lyrics when you want to. Obviously, I won't be because I'm trying to get a reaction done, but... Like a switch, one minute I'm full of bliss The next I'm feeling all pissed Thinking there's something I missed But that thing didn't exist Brains a twist, give a kiss But like everything it missed Oof. Looks like I said the wrong thing again Everything's awkward now Let my isolation begin I'm what? drowning in sorrow And I won't let anyone in I'm feeling so paper thin While standing bottles of gin Countless shots of vodka And a shit ton of whiskey All of this because I always get frisky This question I have is potentially risky If I disappear who truly miss me? What? Come to think of it quite a lot I should be doing something With all of the support I got Why do I think I can handle all of this shit by myself? All I ever do is grab another bottle off of the shelf But they manage to see me and pull me out the mud Wrap their arms around me and give me the longest hug Please wake up, what you're doing is destroying you For you, your letters would have been blank. Is that a reference to blank? Like blank hip hop? If so, that was pretty good, but I don't think it was. But either way, you know, if not, your letters were blank, you know, because if you don't have the support behind you, obviously, you're probably not going to make music or whatever. So I, I can see exactly where he's coming from with that. Feelings that you have for me aren't fake. I want you to talk with me forever. Make this muzzle break. We've been through it all with each other. Through all the mud and the dirt. We've broke down in tears in each other's arms. And we've both been hurt. So I'll seal this with a kiss full of pride. I love you forever. Thanks for always being by my side. Crazy uh. to think that we've been friends since day one. Anytime I'm playing games with you, I'm always having fun. You're thinking philosophical. The distance doesn't mean crap. I love you. Thank you for freeing me out the trap. Family's forever and that's always been the truth. Can't believe how much you've grown as we're living in our youth. We've connected more than ever and there's never been a wall. I love you, thank you for always seeing me through it all And to the family that lives very north of me I like what I see, you're looking happy as can be You've got the talent, kid, please keep chasing your dream I love you, me and you make a hell of a team I see you too, yeah, boosting up that fitness I feel so proud to see you oozing such confidence You're on that grind and yet you help me out along the way I love you both Please keep grinding every day And I know that you do not like to interact But you're a true one and don't lie to me Just tell me facts Yes, you're shy, but you still give me the world And I love you You truly are made out of pearls All these people that I thanked And there's more to witness I gotta thank the tutors Who definitely know their business uh. The 
one who's listening to the song as he mixes yeah. And the one who showed me what the double kick is Now that I know who truly is around I have the confidence to speak out with maximum sound I know that if I'm down I'll give every one of you a call And from the bottom of my heart man I truly love you all Please wake up what you're doing Again, I'm again. I'm. I must say, like this album is pretty good, but it's songs like these that should be on the radio, bro. We need. I'm. I'm telling you. Okay, if anybody who's watching this remotely has anything to do with like Dunedin radio uh, broadcasting, please make a Dunedin radio station with just local Dunedin music. We need to give people from this town more exposure, you know? Other than 660, there's so many other incredible acts that come from Dunedin. Oh, and Mitch James as well. Uh, uh, that should be recognized for their music, but aren't. I mean, hell, I can name so many Dunedin rappers right now. I can name a, a few bands as well. That should be there as well. You know, we need th that radio station. Hell, I'd even make the radio station, but uh, I don't have that ability. So, <laughs> if I did, then yeah, I'd pro I'd probably be doing that. But I don't. I just react to music uh, every now and again when I'm not busy doing other things in my life. Um, but yeah, so this is a very good song, and this might actually uh, be up there with my favorite songs from the album so far. It's very, very well put together song from Subject 95 here, and so far, very good album too. line he leaves on the chorus as well you need to pick up the phone and tell yourself you're never alone because literally in your phone you have so many contacts of like people you know who will definitely be there for you and all you have to do is just you know give them a call or, or a text message so you know very good bit of insightful uh, wisdom from subject 95 Next up, All In Good Time, which is track number seven. Just about halfway through the album. Ooh, that pump and bass though.
Yeah, I knew that I could sing But my brain turned locked on to this little thing How can I be king when I'm constantly waiting for my phone to ring? Nobody calls me up for a track Yeah man, I'll call you right back But deep inside, I obviously know they ran away man They ain't never coming back Ooh, nobody ever calls me up for a track But deep inside they run away Damn Well, I mean I'm 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 putting out this canvas now to you, Subject Ninety Five, because you'll probably end up watching this if somebody tells you about it or you somehow see this. Uh, I am always down to work with artists as long as I've got time. So I mean, if you're ever looking for a, a feature, then hit me up. <laughs> I, I mean, I'm down to do rap features because you know, rapping something I enjoy doing. It's my one of my hobbies as well as obviously YouTube which I'm doing now uh, so yeah but I am always willing to jump on and feature on people's songs but uh, one thing to note with me is I'm also quite a, a, a lazy person or when it comes to my music I take a lot of time to actually you know properly craft it out and stuff so I might not be able to get something to you like <laughs> but I will definitely get uh, a feature or whatever if you know people want it so yeah because i mean i've already had a few hit ups for features like from uh nugget man as well i had to turn that one down though because of going to tertiary and stuff i'd probably have no time to uh do it and i mean obviously i'm working on my own music as many people know still in the closets of getting completed but yeah we'll get there eventually but yeah, I'm, I'm sure, though, that uh, Subject95, there's definitely going to be a few people who rap in Dunedin who will definitely be down to work with you. Because uh, I can I can definitely, as an artist myself, see the potential uh, in your music from just listening to these songs, so... That's what it's deal with, they flee. Nobody wants a song with me. I'm going berserk with the HOP on a blazing track with the EBC. You know what, scrap that, I don't care. I know that I'm not quite there, but give me more time and I'll show that I will rock your world and make your speakers blow. It's all the process, I just gotta wait my turn. But I know right now I make the microphones burn. I took my turn contemplating, and now I find it's not an instant thing, it's all in good time. From the start, I knew I'm So, yeah, nice. Ba basically saying, basically saying that you know, rap is gonna come to you. It's just all in good time. Ni nice, nice message with this song. God damn that, that drum kick. Boom boom. Again, the production on this is just, mmm, <laughs> it's just mmm. Uh, anyway, uh, we're now on to track eight of the album, which is No More. It's a five minute track. This might be the longest one on the album so far, I think. Oh, okay. Is the scope? Oh shit, not again. That seems the most dangerous weapon I use is a pen. After what I write, they keep saying my existence is a sin. Now I entered a fucking struggle I was never gonna win. My destiny already stamped. The paper's cold and damp. I can barely finish writing, it's giving me cramps. The only light giving me vision is my desk lamp. Sitting here dreaming, the prize in my arms, thinking I'm the champ. That was the sign to stop and throw this fucking thing away. Forget about the shit and go on with my day. I got the signal and ended up not knowing what to say. So I kept molding this fantasy world out of clay. I was so dumb to think reality would shift. The truth I heard, man, it hit me like a bullet shit. And at that moment, my whole world started to fall. I guess there is no happiness here after all. Uh. 
This is such an interesting beat to rap over, but he's killing it, bro. <laughs> and it's got that, like, um, in the production, you can obviously hear it's, like, jumping between vocal, uh, points. Uh, it's, uh, I'm trying to think of how I can describe it. It's just like, it's like, sort of cut progression, where they'll, like, cut it so it skips, like, about a second or something, and that's what gets that defined thing. You'll hear, you'll definitely hear it if you listen to a lot of rap, because there'll be a lot of songs that sort of have the same style like this, uh, used in their music. And in fact, some of them actually use, you know, like, vocal chops to actually, you know, make the beats. You know, like, a good example of it is, uh, the song Running by 21 Savage, which is produced by, uh, Metro Booming. You know, it goes, uh, I, I don't know what it's actually saying, but it's, some, it's along the lines of, it, it's taken from, like, a 60s song, but, yeah, you, a lot of songs nowadays do that type of thing, where they'll sample vocals and then have the vocals as the actual melody of the song, which is really sick. It's kind of like what's been done with this song here, only the difference is this is more, uh, just progression of the vocals, whether it is uh, their sampling, cutting the vocals, and then creating the melody out of the vocals. There were some pieces of the puzzle that didn't fit in my head Like how I crowd this harmless one and so much blood shed A flock covered in nature, screen wants to be covered in red A herd, meant to be united once another dead You knew you could take command and they'd follow your every word The evidence presented to them wasn't full, it was blurred There was the first, then the second, looks like I'm the third The victim to a brainwash, my decisions being stirred But looking back it doesn't fucking make sense You just saw the chance to make some fucking extra sense and while I'm smiling, waiting on as suspense You put a mask on, acting like you're so tense What started off as a creative idea Ended up being a threat to my career But my career hadn't even begun So how about fuck you because you think you have won Well you haven't From, from a standpoint, from a standpoint, the uh, production on this song might be the most interesting one so far, but like the way he's using it and rapping over it is something very unique and different that I haven't seen a lot of, and you know, it's definitely catching my eyeball. I'm turning back time, hitting rewind on the tape. Saving my mental health before it's too late And it seems we've both gone our separate ways And that's okay Because I watched the remnants burn out in the blaze And I'm still standing tall Not sure if your ploy included you knocking me down And robbing all of my joy But if that was the case Then bitch I'm not your play toy I'm floating up Loading up these lines about to deploy You try knocking my house down I'm surrounded by broken glass You can take every fucking shot And stick it straight up your ass You looked over every fucking word That I said to you Made all your Comrades beat me up till I'm covered in black and blue And that's the end of the story The heart of the core Why I got my ass in the gear And got off of the floor You could tell the hurting was real But I was constantly sore You won't affect my life ever again You're gone Nope, no more Well, that's too bad because I don't. Well, that's too bad 
Because I'm not. You may call me. Interesting, but uh, yeah, so there you go, that was no more. And uh, although it's one of the more toned down songs of this album so far, he's still managing to he's still managing to bring it and you know kill it again so far this is a pretty well put together album and i find no reasons to really kick anything about the album apart from the two little things that i've mentioned earlier in the reaction but now we move on to track number nine this is infinite uh unlike the uh, actual eminem song <laughs> from 90 96 98 96 90 one of those years i think it's 96 you may call me Infinite oh. in the brief moments that remain to you. <laughs> I, I hear a I hear a raging this guitar, power. so this is gonna oh, be even one of those songs. Just as I thought, it is unrivaled. Not even Sonic will be able to stand against me now. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I'm the tallest of mountains, I am the roughest of waves And if you're here to talk shit, I'll put you into your grave You think this is a joke? Watch out cause your death is imminent But no matter what happens, bitch, I am gonna be infinite With the lyrics I write, each word having a purpose You're running out of breath, better get back to the surface You're in the deep end now, submerged by the rage It's pouring out like blood, scattered all over the page Uh, and still more wonderful. I don't know how Not I feel so about this one. I'm gonna have to get through it to really decide how I feel about it. You saw me when I was weak, you kicked me when I was down. Now you've uncovered the freak, and there's nobody around. I've hid away for some time, waiting for my turn to strike. Get back at those who mock me, right through their head like a spike. Chaos blasting right through you, control it if you can. Seven gems, what I'm packing, I got them all in my hands. You'll mm. think that you've seen a phantom when I put on this mask. And with the shine of the ruby, I will have the last laugh. Weaklings like him one. are of no consequence. Come and show me. A long-awaited reunion and still you spout such nonsense. <laughs> Take this! <laughs> what the actual fuck just went to my ears? <laughs> bruv <laughs> bruv we went from a rap record to heavy metal and like <laughs> what's going on oh oh jesus <laughs> let's just finish the song I was wondering how long he was gonna keep going with that. Consistence is futile. Bring all your forces, even then you'll end up just coming short. One by one, your friends fall down, looks like you've got no support. A little payback from the build up of my beautiful stripes. I'm on a hunting spree, I'm keeping cannon, taking the lives. The weapons battle getting beat, it seems that you'll need to learn. The origin of my power is none of your concern If you try to get close and beat me down you will earn Incineration now that I rule the world all shall burn The strong always vanquish the weak You have only your own frailty to blame Well, well It seems behind that fear is a spark of defiance And those eyes I feel like we've met before You've put up quite a fight I underestimated just how desperately the feeble cling to life. This is reality, Shadow. Your reality. I didn't expect to see you come back alive, but you must admit, it was a truly wonderful show, wasn't it? Uh, well, that was infinite, and uh, yeah, that might be uh, a bit of a miss for me, that one. Uh, I think, yes, it's definitely interesting he went with the uh, sort of rock heavy metal sounding rap beat there and I like the interpolation of the uh, the um, uh, 
um, Sonic, uh, uh, I think sort of Eggman uh, references with those little voice clips. Uh, but yeah, that song wasn't doing it for me. <laughs> but, you know, it's just, just a person, a preference of mine. But yeah. Apart from that, uh, most of the lyrics of that uh, song were, were not too bad. It's just, yeah, that, that sort of style of a song just is uh, just not working for me. <laughs> but, I mean, there'll be the select people who enjoy that, so um, if you enjoy that, then props to you. Anyway, next up, we're moving into track number 10 of the album, which is titled Sly Cooper. <laughs> this comment just, nah, you're definitely a fairy. <laughs> Bruv, <laughs> what is this comment? Okay. Uh, anyways, uh, yeah, this is Sly Cooper, which is track, uh, 10. Okay, here we go. That look, boom bap sound. Look, now I'm a pretty simple man when you think about it. I'm mm -hmm. not a free bird, so I don't try and shout it. But there was something Whoa. tearing up my sweet home and I don't allow it. Jealousy, man, I'd be so much better without it. Looking mm. around me, the sight it makes me hurl. Everybody seems to be paired up with another girl. But Whoa. it's alright, I'll smile and give you a twirl. Be a little performing monkey giving you the world. Can I Not sure how I feel about that lyric. I'll be your little performing monkey giving you the world. <laughs> that, uh, bit, bit questionable of a lyric there, but we'll, we'll, we'll move. Go one day in my life without seeing the shit. All these photos on my feed, man, it gets me pissed. I guess I need to add another to the list. Things I need to improve about myself that don't exist. I'm constantly told I shouldn't make it so grand. But making it shine is not something that I have planned. But now that I have grown, I'll finally take a stand. I'll grab a hold of it and firmly grip it with my hands. Seems like I'm playing golf. I'm out of strokes, I guess. It's Ooh. like an albatross shed on my head and left a mess. Okay, I have another thing I'd like to address. I'd like to get a hold in one just to relieve all the stress. Let me sneak around Paris where all the people are pissed. Find a charming lady there and give her a French kiss. There's nothing in your pocket. Ah, ah, Paris, French kiss. That was good. Now that, that was a good bit of, uh, that was a good bit of wordplay there. I, I, I definitely caught that one. Uh, <laughs> that was a good bit of wordplay there, you know, because Paris is the capital city of France, which most people should know unless, well, you, you're terrible with geography. Uh, and, well, a French kiss, you know, is, it kind, it's kind of straightforward, but very good wordplay. All well, the movements are too swift. I learned the best in the TV is raccoon this. Check this, the shadows on my home. Cold, I'll leave my symbol, that's my mark. Bold, steal the shit back that got. Stole. The thief Ooh. of thieves is my main Go, Go. sneak around the town to back it down with <laughs> yeah, the pain I be living infamous and people know my name You're walking around patrolling thinking you're the big trooper I'll pick pocket your ass like my name was Sly Cooper Sly! Woo. Emergency! Please Sly, can I get a bit of urgency? Why? There's a freaky girl outside and she's saying that she wants Everybody it Everybody be cool I'm on it. Climbing through the fence, see you waiting in the fence. Jump over the fence and you see me pitching the tent. See a girl sitting on the bench, she's a bit of a fox. She loves the loaded weapon and she is searching me. Wait, stop. Because I can't think straight and my vision's a bit blurry. Am I really a furry? <laughs> what? 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 No, uh, no, that, that's outrageous. <laughs> Bruv, that, that is an outrageous lie. <laughs> Am I a furry? <laughs> Subject 95, 2022. <laughs> a couple questionable uh, lines in this song, but we'll just once again gloss over that. Uh, nah, I guess not. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. Right, well that was uh that was Sly Cooper and uh Overall, not bad, apart from a couple questionable lyrics. <laughs> Am I a fairy? Um, and uh, the other one, uh, yeah. Uh, oh, the mon the monkey line, yeah. Those two are a couple of uh, qu 
questionable lines, but uh, apart from that, that song not too bad, and uh, I quite like the uh, boom bap sounding uh, beat there. You know, again, once my old school hip hop heads coming through. Um, <laughs> Uh, but yeah, not too bad of an album. Next up we have track 11, which is Complications. Getting people worried as you go on the run I give you a place to stay in exchange for some fun I thought I won but I was dumb That's when the downfall begun I felt like I got used And I was thrown in the scrap It told me up to see you get any guy you want in the snap You can't get any dick you want and you still tell me that crap Well looks like you had to hear my true feelings in this rap I'm sorry but please do not see this as a threat I'm just simply letting go of something I regret I'm sure you've already moved on, yeah that I bet But it was hard for me or something that I'd never forget Because since that day, I felt my intentions were just better straight All my insecurities, they could never be washed away I'm trying my hardest, but it's not hard for me Bruv, I might not, I, I'm, I mean, I mean, Jesus, what was that accent? Um, um, I mean, I get this song, sp uh, about, uh, his obviously ex, pop, uh, ex, yeah, I guess this I guess this song must be about his ex, but bruv, my man's cry rapping right now. <laughs> uh, I'm I'm not sure how I feel about this. For you at all, take me years to find somebody for you as one quick phone call. Why did it have to be like this? Why did it turn out this way? There were no moments between us that could ever replay. So when you hear the song, please don't get upset, okay? Goodbye forever. I have nothing left to say. Okay, well, obviously, uh, obviously, the, uh, his ex had him quite upset, clearly. <laughs> Are we really about to listen to, like, tw 30 seconds of just straight crying? <laughs> okay, this is a bit overdone now. This is super overdone now, I'm sorry, but this is- this is ruining the song now. Bruv, that was overdone at the end, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but that was- that was- that, <laughs> that was so overdone at the end. Like, you could- I, I- yes, I don't mind you keeping the crying in, but like, you could have cut it after about five seconds. We didn't need the extra 15 seconds of just- <laughs> In there. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Yes, I get, I, I get his, 
ex relationship and the fact that it's probably emotional to rap about, yes. But bruv, I don't want to listen to 20 seconds of someone crying on a rap record. That's not what I'm here for. I'm here for the music. If I want to listen to someone crying, I will just go look up on YouTube crying for 10 hours straight. Um, anyway, uh, next up we have track 12, which is Monster. Kind of, kind of funny, considering I made a track called Rap Monster, but we'll see what this, uh, track title Monster is like. Monster, yeah, what? I, I don't know. Do I care? What do they see? Yeah, what? Okay, I'm sorry. Straight away. Straight away. Bruv, you don't have to talk over the chorus. You could just leave it simply as the chorus itself and then go into the verse. I don't... I don't know about this... Adding this bit to the chorus. I don't think it's serving a, a very good purpose here. And it's... In fact, actually, I'm gonna go as far to say, even though this will be critiqued by him, uh... It's sort of downweighing the song a bit, and, and we've only just started. I still don't know. I still don't care. They're looking at me. Oh, okay. Got the horns going. Having the stream every night when I go to sleep I slowly drift away and then I fall in deep It's pitch black and I'm scared No one can hear me weep It's dead silent and all I hear are little beeps Suddenly it fades in the dimly lit room It's so cold, it feels like I'm trapped in a tomb I'm tied to a chair, I feel my impending doom And I know this game, this act is all courtesy of the the ball begins to take shape I'm horrified of what I see My eyes begin to dilate I see his big pointy grin That he can hardly wait He's got some activities ready As if I were his play date He starts toying with me Getting me worked up He feeds me a sip of coffee From his death cup He turns his back to me he Begins to set up a screen A video is beginning to start up Who's in the video? Shit, it's me Doing all this dumb shit I didn't need to see I'm finding for my life, man, I'm trying to break free He says you'll make my life a misery Just wait and see, I'm surrounded by hallucinations Of him breaking out the cage My veins are popping out and I'm starting to feel the rage And it is him that steps onto the stage Leave the note saying it's my one on a blog so page why do you want to make my life a hell? I have no one to help me, I'm stuck in the shell I see the bodies of his victim as a wretched smell I'm not handling the tension of the terror very well I'm on the brink of death and I know that I can tell He'll just want my body so that he can dwell I'm desperately trying and I scream and I yell But he just slashes at my throat to take my blood cells Monster, Yeah, what? what should I, feel? I don't know Do I care? What do they see? Yeah. Yeah, what? Still don't know how I feel about this chorus, but so far, pretty good first verse. I still don't know. I still don't care. They're looking at me. I wake up in a sweat, safely in my bed. I feel sick, I feel the pain in my head. I'm hyperventilating, I thought that I was dead. But mm. it was just a mental battle in my head. I simply tried to brush it off anyway. But I couldn't stop thinking about what he did say. Several months passed. And I did something dumb, but when I simply thought nothing of it that I was having fun, I took the time to reflect. Oh no, he was right. He was here all alone, just to bring my life right. I blacked out, and simply all I could see was the everlasting figure who would never leave me be. It's the, but I am much stronger now. I fight you man to demon, and I won't back down. He stood still, his wide eyes, he didn't expect for me to come and swinging and to come and collect his head. It was a rough battle, I got beaten down, but I did what I said. I always had my ground. I guess in that point, the fiery fury is what I found. I couldn't afford to lose this as if I wanted to be crowned. I towered over him, but I wasn't done yet. For some revenge, I took a bite into his neck. This fucking demon made me feel like such a wreck. But his flesh is tasty, even though I just took a peck. I ripped out his demon eye and placed it onto mine. And you could see my pupil just begin to shine. I stopped onto his head, and I knew he was dead. And just like before, I woke up in my bed. Although not in a sweat, I have come correct. I can finally let go of the things I regret I've eliminated my number one threat By far the scariest experience was meeting the Monster, Yeah, what's up? What feel? feel great The road dead 
It's a demon. Yeah, what? Still feel great. Yeah, he's dead. I finally win. Yeah. Again, that chorus is just not for me. But the rest of the song is pretty good. Alright. The penultimate song, which is uh, Inside My Head. Okay. By the sounds of this instrumental, it's going to be a more reflective song, probably. What is this meant to be? Another sad song? Well, I'm sorry, but I don't think that's where I belong. I'm here for happiness. Why don't you come along? We have a head on our shoulders and we're staying strong. Sure, if I made the song back one year, you would hear all tears surrounded by all fears. Constantly feeling excluded by all people. Wait a minute, I swear I recognize that instrumental. Hang on a minute. If I can go into here. Can I? No, it's not going to tell me. Normally, sometimes it'll tell you in here if they've borrowed a beat. But I swear that beat sounds familiar to some rap song I've heard. Ears, constantly Maybe it's just me. My headphones on over my ears and shut the world out. Not putting energy into anything, but always feeling burned out. Every single day, watching people do better than me, but that wasn't the case as it turns out. Every time there was a cup of sadness, I would take a sip. Bite my lip and keep my mouth sipped. But now I think I finally got a grip. Wanna see upstairs? Let's go and take a trip. Mm. Wanna see upstairs? Let's go ahead and take a trip. Okay. It's a scuba day. As we're coming up and turning to the right You'll notice everything is shining bright But here's the real kicker Hold on to your tights He's been feeling great for countless days and nights How about that for change? I'm still thinking about how far I've come And thinking this is strange But everything around her is neat and arranged And I'm no longer deranged Everything negative is now a plus I just have so many people close to me who I can trust And I've done exactly what I discussed I ran away from my own self and left him in the dust So how's my head? Ooh. What do I have to answer when I say that I easily sleep in bed? And do you see me in person? All the happiness that I spread So look at all that and guess that's all that needs to be said But if it is an obvious deal, it feels surreal But man, this is exactly how I feel Stick eternal happiness and confidence in a suitcase And man, we have ourselves a deal Good song for the penultimate song of the album. You know, as I said, it it was more of a reflective song, but still, uh, still managed to deliver on uh, sort of the tones of this whole album of uh, overcoming trials and tribulations. And uh, yeah, overall, this album, apart from uh, 
Infinite has been a, a pretty decent album. I've enjoyed it quite a lot. But anyway, uh, we now get to the final track of this album, which is Not Today. And we're in for a long one to finish off. This is seven minutes. <laughs> Machine fighting against the rage. Yeah, I call that one rage against the machine. Machine fighting against the rage. There we go. There's there's the quality bar for, for people to catch. Yes, uh, Rage Against the Machine, of course, the uh, uh, band from the 90s known for their uh, politically activist music. One of my personal favorite bands, too, uh, that I've li listened to. Absolutely love Rage Against the Machine. Uh, but yeah, that was... That was a good bar there. Steps up to the plate, all cowards fear when they hear my name. I'll hold on to the buildings and I'll smash into the straight. You know I'm ten steps ahead of the game. Now I'm on the spread of flames, and my soul's the same. They try to stop me, and they're taking aim. None of their puny little arrows to do it. I got a voice, no use it to make big ass movements. It'll show in the stage, cause that's a place where the pressure's on, I'll see every face. Then watch it closely, see if I make a mistake. Bitch, you know who I am? I never been to break. Not gonna make the same mistakes. No, not today. No, not today. Not gonna make the same mistakes. No, not today. Not gonna make the same mistakes. No, not today. Not gonna make the same mistakes. No, not today. Not It ain't ever gonna happen, no So you might as well pack your shit and go You hear that? That's the sound of the final bell yeah. This journey's gonna be like heaven and hell But in these moments I know that I've trained well Give it all I have till I drop my last blood cell I know the path I walk has been from a dread of fear But I managed to give myself a repair And I knew I had to hit with big tracks I was down but it was time for a comeback oh. Stop till I end up dead Thankfully I wasn't from the war inside my head Had to wake myself up from the dreaming sea I had to learn what a true reality uh -huh. When I got up and I opened my eyes I had another thing in that damn lullaby I didn't Ooh. 
Oh my gosh, he's referencing all of he's referencing all of the songs on this album in this verse. That's sick. Don't quit even if my body's all sore. The two words I don't like to say is no more. The path that I set for myself is definite. I wanna make it so that my story told is infinite. When there's mm. complications, but they've gone away. The monster that I fear has finally passed away. Mm. Everybody stand up, let me hear you clap. Because what you just heard is a victory lap. Mm. I caught on my everlasting emotions on these songs. I don't really give a shit if these songs give me a pain I see you all the time trying to push me away Sorry motherfuckers, but I'm here to stay! Fair enough. And all power to you. Subject, all power to you on that one. Alright, well that appears to be the end of the song itself, but it looks like we've still got two minutes, so we're probably going to get something else here. This is Morse code. Now, I have no idea uh, about any Morse code, so if you're somebody who's good with Morse code, then you'll be able to unravel whatever this is in Morse code. Or maybe I'm completely wrong, maybe it's just the start of the beat. Oh my god, bruv, this is all the voice clips from all the people supporting him. Yeah, he's doing like, he's doing like a sort of last call thing. Bruh, I love when, I, I love when artists do this. You know, uh, Logic did this on his, um, on his uh, Young Sinatra 4 album with the song Witchily, Last Call. That's why I referenced there, he's on his Last Call vibe. Uh, yeah, that's sick. And then I think there's also been some other, uh, um, examples of it as well. It's been a long journey, one that I haven't been part of since the beginning, but I can promise you, I'll be able to keep to the end of the line. <laughs> Dude, oh my god man, what a phenomenal job. The, you know, all that work, so, so worth it. You're getting better and better every check, I swear to god man. <laughs> Can't wait for the future, you know, to see what you make of it. Um, I'll be here the whole journey. This is your calling and all I can ask is what's next? that that is the end of subject 95's the comeback and overall it's going to be uh it's going to be difficult to top uh this album for uh, best rap album in Dunedin this year because that was that was a good album i can't i can't even lie that was a that was a very well put together album uh so i guess with that we shall move into my final thoughts on the album Okay, so, overall, uh, again, I'ma say it, a very, very decent album from him here. And, uh, yeah, compared to, uh, his other stuff he's dropped in the past, like this Homicide remix and the Smoke Free Rock Quest performance, 
this is definitely a uh, an uprising in uh, the quality of his music from Subject 95, and I definitely, like the rest you heard in those voice clips, look forward to seeing where uh, he takes his journey from here, because I am sure that I will be following it pretty closely. Um, but yeah, as in, in terms of the album, uh, overall, very good album. I enjoyed quite a lot of the tracks. Uh, my only track that I didn't enjoy was, as I mentioned, Infinite. I, I just was not vibing with that track, uh, but everything else apart from it is really solidly put together and definitely shows a uh, a level of musicality from Subject 95 that I have not yet uh, seen from him before. And uh, it just m makes me interested to see where he can go from here. Uh, in terms of each individual songs and what I thought, uh, uh, my favourites from the album, uh, top three, would probably have to be... Uh, I will probably have to stick... Uh, Never Alone at number three, then I'd probably put All In Good Time number two, and honestly the final track, Not Today, I would probably put as no number one. Like, I think Not Today was a really good closer to the album, especially with that uh, um, vocal clips at the end to sort of tie in together everything. And also the way in Not Today as well, he was literally going over and literally um, talking about every single track in the album in verse 2 as well. There was, was a, a very cool thing to see as well, sort of like wrapping up the album in a song. I found that very cool. But I like the, the themes of what he was talking about in Not Today, and for that reason, that's why it's my favourite song. Least favourite songs? Well, well, there's only really one, which I've already mentioned, which is Infinite. I didn't really uh, like the uh, heavy metal sort of uh, style he was going with there, and I thought it was just not really a song that fitted well with uh, this album personally for me. I feel like this album was more of a, uh, a sort of confessional style album rather than like an album of just heavy metal style rap music. <laughs> so uh, that song may have fitted better on like that sort of an album, but yeah, it didn't fit well for me in here. So that's why that is my uh, least favorite song from the album. But yeah, overall, uh, it's a pretty decent album. So uh, that of course brings me to uh, my rating. Now, of course, if you saw the uh, only other Dunedin rapper uh, album review I've done, which is the prologue, I rated that a 5.5, which is literally just above average. So, uh, in terms of this album, I think out of a score of 10, I'm going to give this, I think, a, uh, a 7.5. Yeah, uh, 7.5 or a 7. Now, I might drop it to a 7. 7 out of 10. Yeah. Um, 7 out of 10 for this album. I think it is, I think it is a good album, but I still think there's definitely more work that can be done, which Subject also knows, uh, in order to capitalize and produce something that's better. But I think this album is about a 7. Minus the bad track, and if that had been replaced with another decent track, I probably would have bumped it to a 7.5. But, uh, yeah, it's gonna be a 7 out of 10 from me, and, uh, yeah, overall, a very solid album, and uh, I guess to uh, wrap up this video, uh, th uh, this is definitely probably going to be in the top five albums or music projects to release from uh, Dunedin this year. So uh, I look forward to seeing what else gets dropped in the later part of 2022 and whether me myself can actually get my EP done and release it at last. So you'll have to stay tuned and see whether that becomes a reality or not. <laughs> uh, and uh, also I look forward to seeing if any other artists drop albums or stuff this year. I mean, of course there has been a few artists dropping things here and there with, you know, Nugget Man's dropped his two uh, lots of EPs, which I've listened to. Uh, but if people want to see an in-depth listen to of that from me, then be sure to leave a comment down below and I might get to that at some point. And I also have yet another album to check out from a Deneen artist, which is the one by... Uh, sick boy uh so i will get to that whenever i can 
maybe that might be uh, next week's music Monday. But yeah, uh, so that's going to wrap up this uh, video of reacting to Subject 95's album, uh, The Comeback. And uh, if you guys enjoyed this video, then be sure to slap the like button down below and leave a comment about what you guys thought personally about each and every song on this album as well as uh, the video. And if you're new to my channel and you've not seen my content before, then uh, I'm that automotive guy. I make automotive content as well as musical content. So if you enjoy those type of things, then be sure to hit that red button below and tap the bell so you're up to date with when I drop my videos. But until next time... I have been that automotive guy or seven signing off. Goodbye.